Hi guys and welcome to this vlog if you can say it like that. We have arrived to our Airbnb flat something in London. Um, we actually arrived yesterday evening but we just went to a airport hotel or something and just stayed the night and we just arrived here. We have well didn't just arrive. <laughs> We have been here for a little over an hour where we have relaxed and we have gotten some food and stuff like that. So now we are actually going out and explore London a little bit to the M&M store and just walk around in that area and then take the underground to somewhere where we can get some food. Because we're just planning on eating here because Tomorrow, for lunch and dinner, we are going to eat with Amanda, so that's going to be nice. So we just want to have a casual, small dinner here in the flat. Um, so that's where we're going. I can show you around a little bit and um, it's not very big, but we're only going to sleep here for two nights, so it's okay. Dinner area, kitchen. Bathroom, TV, fridge, bed, John, <laughs> <laughs> and a wardrobe with a full length mirror. That's me, right there. Well, the bathroom is actually quite nice, if you think about it. Nice mirror and everything. It's really nice. So I think I can stand here and do my makeup very easily. Good lighting too. And it's like 36 degrees outside or something. It's insanely warm and the lighting sucks. So we found some shade in Hyde Park and ate lunch. It was okay. It was okay. Yeah. So let's go explore London. And I will take you guys with me, as always. I don't know if I'm going to talk, but I will take you with me. Makeup is off. 
I'm really enjoying those face handles. No. Some micellar water. Just a little tiny bottle. I'm so excited to see the girls tomorrow. So nothing exciting is going to happen here. We are going to play cards, drink beer. And we just had dinner. It was a lovely upgraded sandwich burger thingy that John just made. And we didn't spend a lot because we bought the reduced items in Sainsbury's. So it's really nice. Sorry about the air thingy. It's so warm if you don't have your one. My skin is so bad because of the airplane. It normally don't break out, but it's going to be fine. But thank you guys for watching today. It was a short one, but I think I'm just going to put it together with the one tomorrow. So, sleep tight if you're going to sleep. So yeah, obviously the bridge wasn't actually thrown into the river. They did use CGI to make that happen. <laughs> and you'll be very glad to know that no muggles, you recognize this, no muggles were harmed. <laughs> Do I have any people that would like to have a Ron pick? Anyone? 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 Are you sure, Ed? Are you sure? I feel like Ron with that hat would look great. Ripping them until you get, you get buckled. Now, buckles are actually caught on them, hanged, not hung, okay? Hanged, you understand? <laughs> Ready to finish all times. Hanged, set, hanged, hanged, not hung.
ground, <laughs> ground floor. Upstairs, first floor. Upstairs, second floor. This is not difficult. We're ground floor. Now let and tell us. No, 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 no. Right, let me just help you here, right? If you check the hotel in the UK and they give you a key and they say you're in a first floor room and you then go to a ground floor, that's called breaking and entering. That's the same for five stretch. I don't remember if we talked today, but we just got home. It's like 10 p.m. or something. Well, well, well. Half past 10. Yeah, half past 10. <sighs> the shadow. I'm really sorry. If it has been a busy day and we... Well, I haven't been confident enough, I guess, to vlog. But in the morning time, we made some breakfast. It was really nice. And then we went to see... Amanda and Aaron and Claire um, and Amanda's husband John um, it was really really fun and we had an amazing time just really really nice to meet them finally we had lunch where we got fish and chips and then we went Amanda John and my boyfriend and me we went to the Harry Potter tours not the studio I think but guided tour in London we walked for like two and a half hours so that was really hard and long and tough basically <sighs> I'm trying not to get the shadow in my head it's really difficult as you can see my makeup is uh, half off because we have just been sweating this much and it's been raining and so the hair product to us was really really nice wasn't it it was he's nodding and then we were stuck in the underground for like an hour because we couldn't there was just too many people but we made it to the Jack the River and Sherlock Holmes guided to in London where we were driving in a bus in half of the time and now we're here and me and Amanda we have talked a lot and we have been it, it has been amazing to meet her finally and it was really really sad to say goodbye to her I'm not really good at goodbyes, but it was a see you later and not a goodbye, so that's nice. Okay, so now I'm laying in my bed because we have walked like 23,000 steps. Yeah, and it's like almost 17 kilometers. I walked almost uh, 28,000. Yeah, and John walked almost 28,000 steps today. It's 21.3 uh, kilometers. 21.3 kilometers. That's a lot. <laughs> um, so we are off to bed now. I need to eat the rest of my sandwich for dinner because we were in a rush because of the traffic in the underground. And then we're going to bed and then tomorrow we are leaving for Brighton and I'm really excited to get there and see it finally and get a flat with a view because we have ordered the airbnb flat with the ocean view which is so good night and i will see you guys tomorrow i know i just said goodbye and good night but I just wanted to say something to Amanda and that is that it was really really nice to meet you I love you so much and it was just really really nice to meet you in person and it was it's like unreal that we have met and your husband is awesome he is he's really really nice it was just really really nice to meet you finally and just meet you in general 